Okay, so imagine like rugby on skates. That's how most people think of it. You've got five girls on each team, one jammer, and they're the only person that can score. And then you've got your four blockers. The jammer has to lap the opposition, and you get a point for the passing the other person's hips. Um, but the blockers have the fun part because it's their job to help their jammer through and smash the opposition off the track. So who's the blocker here? So the right. blockers are anyone that does not have a cover on their helmet. Okay, you see right. The stars? Yeah. That's the jammer. So they're the only person that can legally score and call off the jam. They're the speedy, chasey ones. Yeah. Right, okay. They're the ones whipping around the track constantly. And yeah, and then all the other girls who are just hitting each other and getting in each other's way, that's how they stop her from scoring. And how are the London Rocky Molders doing today? Um, they're doing fantastically. Yeah. But there are some amazing teams playing today. Yeah. Who's the, who's the top teams of today? Well, London Roller Girls are playing, who are our other London-based team. Mm -hmm. Central City from Birmingham, uh, Brighton Rockers, they're amazing. Um, I believe... Brighton Rockers, good name. Yeah, they're, they're fantastic. <laughs> yeah, we, we played against them recently and they were just amazing. Um, there were two men's teams played yesterday. Um, I don't think oh, so they, men do get involved in this? There are more and more and more teams coming up all the time. But yeah, if you're interested in any London teams, uh, there's uh, Southern Discomfort. Southern Discomfort. Who are a men's team. Um, and I think the Crash Test Brummies played yesterday. Played yesterday. Was that inhuman? Inhumanly. Inhumanly. Cardiff, right? Yeah, that's cool. uh, What's the worst injuries you girls have ever got? Uh, I had ligaments in my wrist and um, did something to my ribs that I'm not 100% sure what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Two people blocked her at the same time, one at the front, one in the back, and she just got squeezed. Wow. So yeah, lots of bruises. Although uh, bruised fingers. One of our one of our other girls who can't be here um, took a bad fall and dislocated her kneecap. So that was a bit nasty. And there's always like broken ankles, yeah. collarbones, that's quite common, and ribs. Um, she's our A team, she also plays for Team Sweden. She broke her ankle but was literally within two weeks of being fixed, she was back playing. You can't really let it go once you're playing. Yeah, right. It's one of those things you get addicted to. It's the thrill of it. It's the buzz and the. Uh... And you don't want you don't want to be taken over, and you don't want to let your other girls down. Sure. Well, thank you very much, the, the uh, London Rock and Rollers, veterans of the roller derby world. <laughs> thank you so much.